little neck around here and uh, I know it's been a month ago at the moment we're just doing the last of the Tokyo treat box that I've subscribed for and then I'll be going on to doing reviews again of games and so on um, so the last one that we're doing and I'm here with Jamie again <laughs> is that the Easter box, the April one, which... Just hope it's not a prank. <laughs> no, it's not April Fool. It'd be luckily. funny if it was sent to us on April the 1st, though. It wasn't sent too many yeah, days after saying, it. Yeah, I'm just saying, it would have been funny if they sent it then. True, true. Because then they could have actually put something in that would have fooled us. Anyway, something in here is definitely bigger because they put elastic bands on it. And it's got a bit of a bulge. And it's got a bit of a rise. Obviously as normal, which I do recommend whenever you get the boxes, you open it and take out the drink and put it in the fridge. Um, so as soon as you get through your door, take it out, put it in the fridge and keep it cool. Yep. Um, so let's get cracking on. As usual, to subscribe for the box, you go on the website and you can make up your subscription. It's $35 for a um, monthly subscription, um, which you pay each month in advance. And uh, they got different plans for you to choose from. Um, what plan did you go for, man? So I, I think it was the uh, pay a month in advance for 12 months, I think. Something like that. Um, obviously, you got to make an account and all. But after that, you'll get one every month as long as you pay. And if for, <laughs> for whatever reason you don't have enough in your account at the time you got to skip a month option and um, they'll send a inf like receipt saying you didn't have enough please put in more so as I said it's a Easter themed it's one it's a, there's like a puzzle type yeah, thing yeah for sure they've got like a little puzzle I Easter can't puzzle I'm trying to figure it out. Come on. I'm going to start like that. Only vertically. Wait a minute. Vertically and horizontally. That's Anna. Yes. No diag. That's diagonal. That's diag. That's diag. Okay. Okay. And lines each square can only be passed through once when you're finished. Read the order of squares where a turn was not made. Come on. Okay, I can't do that. Can't do the puzzle. So. The booklet that's really cute, it's got a bunny Easter egg hunt, is volume 28, April 2018. Um, so, little Easter hunt. So, spring is here and it is time to celebrate. With spring comes comfortable days, bright sun and the popular Easter holiday. In honour of the change of season, we wanted to help welcome the colour back to the world around you with some fun, colourful, fruity foods and Easter themed snacks. You can even find one of your favourite eggs, Gudetama, can never say that, Excuse in her, this box. We hope you enjoy the spring weather and holiday with the Easter hunt box. Um, I can never say it, I think it's Gudetama, it's Good a time. very popular, like, egg Character. Well, it did say it was an egg, didn't it? Runny egg so. character, and they've even got this cafe or restaurant dedicated you to just that. think do it in order this time? Like, do it in order as? So, do we have premium or just a classic? We've got both. Let's okay, so the first one is the we're Easter. Gonna, Ooh. No, we're going to start classic. And oh, then we're going to start with classic, so we'll start with the first classic one, which is Kiro... Kyoro Chan's custard pudding snack. This thing? Yeah, it looks like it. So, this is a custard pudding snack. Apparently. So, a weird 
bird thing on it. Seems like something you would buy in a um, little corner shop. Find it, yeah. But only this Japanese. 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 Seriously? Japanese. I always mess it up, boys, because you say Jap Japan. You're not the brightest, are you? <laughs> so, you know, Japan is. Which, I'm an idiot, so. No chlorine there. Huh. Hang on. It's a, it's a mm -hmm. little task just to get into it. You're a task. Okay. As, uh, Is this still at a five? No. <laughs> As with the last one, it's one to five. One being wouldn't try again, and it five like. being. It's got, it's got a couple of like small colours that you can slightly see, like this. Yeah, if you can just slightly see two. purple. Yeah, I'm just trying to get them to see the colour, which is hard to see. Like there, see, you can see the purple. Um, purple and five pink. being, we were definitely uh, regularly, and it's very nice. Okay, ready? Hmm. Give it a four. Actually, no, Good. I'll give it a five. I would give it a five, yeah. Don't taste like custard, it tastes like, um... It sort of tastes like they're outside the pockies. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And it's really nice, and it's got a nice crunchy inside. See if I can bite one and a half and show you. Yeah, you got a crunchy inside, sort of like a Malteser, like coated outside and crunchy inside. For other countries, Malteser, it's like um. Chocolate coated outside with a crispy inside. Basically. Yeah, you can see the next one. I I tripped over my own tongue trying to say that one. That one. The next one is a Pacuncho Disney custard pudding biscuits. Disney? 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 Yeah. Ooh, we got something Disney related. So it's got a, oh, I find it. It's, we got three. Oh, three. In no, it. Wait, oh. Wait, it does have my favourite character on it. Never mind. You, you can have the pink one. Oh, pink. Seriously? They basically just got the different Disney characters. Saying Easter happiness. Okay. Favourite Disney character of all time. It's like vacuum pack. Like the crisp. You're a vacuum pack. Ooh. It's very strong. It smells more of like toffee or something. No, not toffee. What? Oh, I can't think of the thing. I Wait don't a minute. Know, you know, but like the, you know, like like the like stuff it. in the corner? You know, the corner the yogurts? Oh, milk corner, yeah. It smells like that, doesn't it? It smells yeah, like some of the yogurts. Yeah, it smells like some of the corner stuff. We didn't show them. This one has a. What, what is that? Got ja uh, Japanese. That's one of the chipmunks, I think. Yeah. And mine... They have pictures on it. That's something irrecognisable. Irrecognisable. Might be a comedian. Looks kind of like a comedian. I mean, who's this? Is that... Is that Anna? Yeah. Let it go! Okay, Wait, no, no, here's this, um... I'm boring, you can see. I'm giving these a five, no. Definitely not shareable, I'll say. Give it a four. That's something you want to just like hide away and eat it to yourself. So not much. Weird to me. I, I, just, I don't even know one. <laughs> like a small snack, like out and about, fair enough, eat them. <laughs> but we eat them as part of a mini box or anything. So, next. Wait, who's that? No idea. Kind of, some, I believe, some things like Disney and certain things, like with anything, we don't get all of it. 
like we don't have all the chat the Disney shows and all that here in the UK um Calbee plum seaweed chips seaweed yeah what was that one that was the looks like that so is that this one yeah yeah that's me by the way <laughs> no looks like that it's very colourful and even as a character, like usual with like Japan. A potato chat. Well, it's also got a uh, just a picture of some people. Don't know who they are. <laughs> yeah, um, as Japanese we said people. in the other one, we say crisps, not chips. <laughs> chips are like potato things you have for cooked dinner. Yeah. <laughs> okay, let's see what this smells like then because to be honest when tasting things the best thing is you don't smell them because then you want nine times out of ten decide that you won't like it up on the smell yeah but you know but it's just human habit it smells like potato it smells like very salty crisps Weirdly taste like a shivers through my whole body. I don't know how to describe it. I'll, I'll, I'll give it a one though. You never have it again. <laughs> I did it. I did that gave me shivers through. Oh, uh, one. No, can't. Ben has spilled that all over my floor. Yes. Joking, no, I am. <laughs> Next one is the. Umaya, umaya, cheese. At least I can say the second word. Maybe. That's in here. Ah, oh. ah, oh, looks like those bars we had before. Wait, it's dipped in something. Wait a minute, it has a character on the back that I think we've seen before in our previous one. Yeah. We need to find what that's all because I don't think it's just a mask. Let me get. Let me guess. You're gonna say it's very cutesy. No, yeah. maybe. <laughs> the same company who brings you the popular Umaibo, not Amiibo, Umaibo, whatever, <laughs> brings you this satisfying corn puff snack, Umaiwa. The flavor is inspired by cheese fondue. Enjoy the rich cheese flavours you snuck on these yummy ring treats. Yeah, in um, Britain we don't have a Very lot Very cheesy. We don't have many... Whoa. Um, oh, whoa. Many things like described as corn snacks. Because I don't think we normally have them made out of corn. I don't know. Even if we do, they don't usually just say corn snack. Like corn puffs or anything. And again, uh, knickknacks are made from corn. Yeah, but you can tell. No. Hmm. Tastes nicer than it smells. It smells too cheesy, if you know what I mean. Tastes like a weird what's that? True. I'd probably give it about a three. I wouldn't mind having it for a lunchbox or something. Hmm, I'd say two or three, because I still would prefer what sets. Mm -hmm. One more got just for life. I know. I know they're crackers more than crisps, but Cheez-Its, I guess. I don't think I've ever had Cheez-Its. They did sell them here. Oh no, I'm not going to put that last there. We'll never eat pile. <laughs> Somebody in my family made the seaweed. <laughs> Maybe. Okay, another Yamaibo Teriyaki Burger. Oh yeah, this is the thing that says that um, is the popular thing, isn't it? Because that's the same company as the one we just had. A burger? We had, but then again, it's teriyaki. Um, we had something like this um, in the other box. 
It's not the character again. I think it is a mascot, but I swear I've seen something somewhere else too. He's very happy, happy and cutesy. I'm not quite sure what it's supposed to be There's though. There's a monkey! There's a monkey. Oh yeah, the, even the uh, big has eyes. I find it creepy when they put eyes on food though. Okay, I'm no. A I'm a burger. I'm a burger. I, I still got the cheese. However, uh. You take a bite of it because I don't know if I like teriyaki. I'm like just, they got teriyaki <laughs> chicken in like oh. Subway and that. I've never tried it though. Do I? I'm not a fan of trying think new things usually. See what I go through. Trying new things. I might have my comfort zone. It's not bad. It like scares to try it and then you have a massive bite. It's me. What do you expect? Not too bad actually. Mm. It does taste bite. I give it a three. It does taste like it's got meat, like the burger yeah, taste. Definitely just like it's meat. got like this um slight spice and the tinge of teriyaki, which I really like. <laughs> um She's probably gonna make it a four or five. I think the only that down is what it's made of, because I don't think the crisp sort of thing texture sits mm. very nice with that. So like, I'm gonna like say uh, four. I love the texture. I love things that are, because it reminds me of those snacks when you as a child. Those type of snacks you'd nom on. <laughs> nom. These things. <laughs> okay, next Ooh, is... Ooh, healthy snacking squishy lemon... Ooh, gummies. I'm loving the scent of it. Ba -ba -ba -ba. I'm loving it. Okay. Why do I do the McDonald's things? It looks like that. So they got actually healthy something Oh, they are very squishy. It is very squishy feeling, in it? Um, I think it's made of 100% lemon. That is going to be sour. Can I have a whole pack then? No. We got to try them. But... Ooh, it's got one of these opens. Ready, hand? Ha! Never mind that, I messed it up. Let me try again. Oh, it's got a, it's a resealable package. I'd say one thing that has disappointed me is you know you got fruity tooties. They now got the oh, <laughs> um, they now oh. got the sugar free range, but they taste way different, and it's really disappointing because I like trying the sugar free stuff when I can, and it's just too <sighs> disgusting. So, but they're in resealable packs and like the tutti frutties. So it seems to be covered in a layer of sugar. Ready? Three, two, one. Not much flavour initially. No. Really gummy. Mmm. Nice. I give a three. There wasn't much to it, but I like the chewiness of the gummies. It's really healthy snacking, because I swear it was covered in a layer of sugar. Maybe it is, but still healthy snacking. 17 grams of sugar. Healthy. Healthy. Well, I guess the lemon part of it is healthy, because I don't think they've added actually much sugar, because think of how much sugar, I think lemon has a lot of sugar in it anyway. Mmm. So... Plus, sugar isn't bad for you, per se. Per se. Let me finish my. my okay, phrase. okay. Uh, well, do the DIY kick. A kick? Kick. kick last. Afterwards. I like the sound of that because it looks like a oh, banana thing. I had a look Chocolate and banana. it seems pretty easy. It looks very cool. Also has a monkey. Some tacos gr gr grilled corn flavour. Taco. Don Taco. Whoever Don Taco is when he's at home. That thing. Ooh. That thing. <laughs> it shows corn on the cobs and I absolutely love corn on the cobs. Not I, not I bat it on. Oh, it's got that dude on it. 
in Mexico. In Mexico. Also got another one of these things. You could probably make that dude come alive. Ready? I bet this is gonna be a bit spicy though. Ah, yeah, it says just grilled corn um grilled corn is often topped with butter and soy sauce in Japan. Why does it smell like a split cream donut? I didn't smell that. Without the cream. I don't know where he's getting his smells from. Everyone has different senses. Same but what? Two. Oh no. <laughs> one No. I guess you're giving it a one. Uh -huh. So put it in the pile with the uh, seaweed. Away. Oh my definitely, god! Definitely looks. It looks like they look like Doritos. Tastes nothing like it. <laughs> Since I grabbed it, I may as well eat it. Yeah, I um, give it a two. What are you giving it? No, one. No, never, never. One. Yeah. God, you nearly forgot to give that inside. I said one. Next okay. one Can is the caramel corn share pack. I hear Americans going on a lot about caramel corn. Mm. Or caramel, as some people say. For the cute girl, you get the cutesy looking one, which I accidentally opened up. And. They look actually like what's it this time. Like the curve. I got one with the love hearts. What are they called? Cheetos? Yeah. Yeah. Okay, uh, four packets of them? Cheetos is. Five? Five. No, four. Five? Oh, yeah, four. Never mind. Count England. Wait, that's not even English. I, I can't even Can't math. count. <laughs> can't math. Ah. Yeah, they all got different designs on it. They got different names. Paku Paku, Moju Moju, Perori, Poi Poi, Poi Poi. <laughs> and they all got numbers. This one's three. This is four, two, and one. Just and then keeping track of what they smell. They actually taste different though. They do smell like caramel. Do they actually taste different though? That is the thing. Nah. Mm. I have no trouble. He's having trouble. <laughs> I'm not even trying to milk this either. I'm out of breath. Can you help me? Please. I've actually given myself a break, Nate. So she opens this now. I've loosened it first. You open it from the side. <laughs> no, it just doesn't taste right. It's like crisp. why does it taste like those little? Strawberry things we had before, just without the strawberry uh, flavour to it. Yeah, it's got caramel inside. It just doesn't taste like a good mix. I love it. I'll give it a four. I'll give it a one. Caramel and crisps just doesn't sit right to yes, it me. Does. Yes, it I does. know Americans seem to really like it too. The mix of caramel and crisps or chips and it just does not taste right. Yes, it does. He disagrees. So that was all the classic stuff. Now we're going to the premium, I guess. Kind of varied and what was nice and what wasn't. They mainly the things that didn't taste very nice to me and half the time to him was to Chris. Easter banana. Banana. Kit Kats. I was waiting for another pack of Kit Kats to come through. 
Yes, yes, but I love them. You don't usually like banana flavored things, do you? I do. I just don't like banana milk. Ah. Or milkshake. I've got this one. Don't 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 say anything to me this time. And don't laugh at me, please. And we too stronger. <laughs> Be true to it now. Please stop. Easy. First. Ow. I slap myself. Oh, little cutesy. Yeah, the little cutesy one. It's like a green and yellow packet as a bunny thing. And there's a golden packet. Wait, did, did I actually show the pot big packet? No, I didn't. It's got a banana on it. Can't read that, it says Easter break. Seems it allows you to write your message. So I think you can yeah. give them out as gifts. Like, I don't know. No, I dropped mine. Like don't eat that more with me. It says, have a break, have a Kit Kat. You know, the Kit Kat uh, slogan. What is the slogan? Yeah. <gasps> oh! So you're going to. And as. Because I hate when people. Tastes like banana cowball that I used to love as a kid. Yeah, it does. Mmm. Can eat this all day. <laughs> Double up, eh? Double up or not? Yeah, ten. Uh, well, yeah, double up, ten. That's delicious. Well, then again, if we both give it five each, it is ten, and it? Oh my god. I need to sleep more. Okay. Then it's the afternoon tea. White no. chocolate. Oh, yeah. Good Tama. No, do you want to say this one? Good Tama candy. Who is this? Why? The one and only lovely lazy egg Good Tama. This tasty yogurt flavour candy is filled with rich orange juice or sauce. All the candies also have various hue. The time of facial expressions on them, which expression is your fave? It looks cute as heck. The class, the Japan Lazy Egg. <gasps> <laughs> this reminds me of me in the morning. <laughs> it's so adorable! Like, uh, oh my what god. What do you rate this uh, similarity? A uh, five. Four and a half. Just doesn't have your beard and moustache. I know. I look more in more handsome. That's a adorable little hat. Well, I don't feel to feel squeaky. You see them in the back of it. Slightly if I you know you can't see through that. Open zit now. Why would I open a zit? <laughs> no, open it. So you got sights. Ah. So they're individually wrapped, and yeah, you got like again. little oh. expressions. Sweets. Do you want to go out and see what expression is our favourite, as they say? Well, should we, we should taste it first. Taste them first. Come on. Hey, okay, God. Let's do this like small sweets at la. It's kind of oval shape. Hmm. Cough like lo lozenges or hard Those are usually quite nice though. Um boiled candy, I think they call them. Yeah. Boiled sweets. I'm pretty sure this one is my favourite. Cause it's what it's the one on the packet, it's me. I like that one. It'll thank me every day. Angry or <laughs> having to go at me? Mhm. Mm no, don't do anything wrong. I wouldn't say do nothing wrong. When did Just, you have two? I didn't. This is your other packet. When did you say that? 
that? I don't know. I don't remember. I thought you put it then forgot. Um, Can I put it back in the pack? Because this um, seems like it's going to be a long time one kind of thing. But I'll give it, I'll give it three. Hey, what are you doing? Put it out there. So, I give that a five. I love them. I ha love hard boiled sweets. Afternoon tea, white chocolate milk tea. I don't usually like cold tea. Things. Do they have, they have peat tea twice? I hate yeah. when they do that. I hate when they repeat words in a sentence or description. Like when I did that uh, thing on my phone and uh, it fused two things and they had the same thing and it was like GT, GT. <laughs> Super Saiyan 4, Super Saiyan 4. Yeah. Yeah. He loves Dragon Ball. I don't. <laughs> Obsession. Not, not, not the drink, Dragon Ball. But yeah, the you don't even know if you're going to like this. If you? I do, I probably will get obsessed with it. Would you? Would Madam like to try the first set? Sure. Sure. I'm not sure on the smell. This doesn't smell the greatest at all. Well, you look. Stop with the pinky. You're not posh. <laughs> it smell. It doesn't smell right. Tastes all right though. Not too strong. If you ask me, it smells gone off. It's not going off. It's quite nice. Not too chocolatey. I bet not though, if this milk. was warm, it was lovely, but it felt very. It, 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 well, yeah, felt very water, very watery. Went very well, she had. <laughs> watery. Maybe you, are, you can warm it up too. I don't know. Only hmm. problem with getting oh. things like this, you can't. I think I will. I, I think I am now obsessed. No. <laughs> no. It's a sh ah, boss. Bossy. 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 Okay, go. Bossy. That then. Baby bear gummy. Ba ba ba. ba that's baby bear. Ba 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 ba, ba, ba baby bear gummy. Ba 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 baby gummy. It's a tiny one, so it's. This popular dagashi snack. Is a fun, colourful gummy snack that is shaped like cute bear cubs, like, um, yeah, basically gummy bears. The various colours remind us of the many Easter egg designs that this holiday is known for. We hope you enjoy the many fruit flavours which flavours your favourite. It's flavor. definitely something you would give to a little kid. Yeah, in like a snack box or like a... Victory. Or for going on a trip or holiday. Or just a snack on. Bear Looks or like Harry Bows. Yeah, it does. Uh -huh. It's the only packet, so... Fine, and you can open this one, since I opened the last one. A chunk. No, I'm kneeling. I'm not actually a shot. Lies! <laughs> She's very small! I'm five foot one. That's not too you small. You keep telling yourself that. Keep telling yourself that. I was in the It's open. It's very hard to open. You got orange or red one. Mm. I think it's just like strawberry. Oh. They do look mm. like gummy bears. Mmm. I'm a gummy bear. Oh, I'm a funny, yummy, yummy little gummy bear. The yellow one doesn't taste like oh, well. nice. I think it's more gold. Only problem is there's only four small things in each pack. It looks like there's two golden ones. No, that's the orange. orange. I had can yellow. I have the, uh, can I have the green then? I hope this is like apple and not like pear. I'll, I'll show you five. They're nice it's... little snack. Not too gummy. Mm. Yeah, fine. Definitely suitable for younger children. Even though there's only like four in the pack here. Yeah. Rich. Kids wouldn't be happy about that. They'd be screaming your head over. Colourful seeds. 
soft candy. So this is. It looks like shib. It looks like a shib. But bangs you get with a lolly. Yeah, it looks yeah. Like. But I tend to get creative with this fun mix and match snack. This soft candy snack includes a mix of ramoon, grape, and orange flavors. I we don't know what ramoon, ramoon is. Ramoon is sort of like lemonade. You can also eat two flavors at once to create other fun flavors such as green apple and orange juice. Which combination will you create? Well, we um, I found out last time that ramoon is sort of like lemonade. Yeah, I I'm guessing ramoon is the purple one, or is that the that's really blue one. Oh, hey. It's just... Yeah. We will need water anyway. For DIY, apparently. From what I could tell. Hmm. Okay. That is very nice. Yeah, that was very nice, that blue. Yeah, I think that's why they gave us so many, because they didn't actually just like... I think this is the grape one. Orange taste. Like orange... Okay, this, so this one is like a jelly bean. Yeah. The grape one. Hmm. Packet is a bit deceiving if you don't normally have these things. Because it shows Idiot. a glass. Idiot. It shows a glass with a straw. So you think, okay, you put in water and make you know drink. I'm going to make the apple flavour. Grape tastes a bit weird. Ooh, Let's see if I can push them together to increase the flavour. Aha! They've infused. <laughs> I don't think I really like the Ramon. I like it. See, make some orange and grape. Do what I did. Infuse them. Oh, never mind them. It does get kind of apple ish but mm. not much. No. Kind of gets a tinge of the sourness of apple, in my opinion. And it was orange and the, what was it, Ramon? I should realise that's a character in my uh, Xenoverse 2 game, his name's Ramon. Ramon is a weird alien thing. Okay, okay, what was this again? This was supposed to be basically just orange aid. Wait, what number were you giving us? I'm giving it a three. I'm gonna... I should give it a four, actually. I could be a thing and say because it deceived me. No, it yeah. deceived you. You're just silly, and it doesn't. It's not English. It's not in English. It's something that is I'm very annoying. The next thing. How was that? That's okay, it. the only thing we got left now is the, the DIY. What does it actually say? I mean, read it to you guys. Ready to make your own sweet choco ban banana. With this DIY, you get to a fun decorate your own chocolate choco, choco banana. With chocolate cream and colorful choppings. Choco bananas are a popular snack at Japanese festivals. Now you get to experience one as well with this DIY kit. Full of. I had a snack of that again as well, I did. Well. Okay. So. I was about to call off some monkey, but I think it's a little girl. It's a little girl. <laughs> I think the. Oh, yeah, this one did come with the instructions for it, didn't it? Oh, so this one's pretty simple. I can I see you literally you just you just get out the chocolate things. Well, maybe not. No. Okay. It looked like you needed water when I had glanced through, but obviously. Oh, when you I can smell glanced. the banana instantaneously. I smell it when I had it down on my leg. Okay, you got a packet of the sprinkles. It's like you're making, you know, those uh, what are they call dab. The um lot the ice it's cream dab. lollies. Dab. No, they were literally just called dab. Oh yeah. Yeah, yeah. So you get them, but you know this is a banana, and you get 
chocolate sauce. Yeah, the colourful toppings and choco cream. Okay, I'm, I'm holding it upside down. Then you put those back in there. Point to separate sections of the right side of the tray. Oh, you get one stick. One stick. Okay. It's fair enough. You've got a little Tiny. funky section that basically says, hold me. Yeah, it doesn't actually say, but it just shows because I think that's like for extra grip. Am I right? Probably. I should show them. I have showed them the... Yes, yeah, probably better. Okay, I guess. Uh, I've got my thumb in it. It's very thick. So it's a very thick, like... Mixture. Chocolate mixture. Yeah. I'm trying to guess how you know, the woman. So yeah, that's the kit. And you got a sprinkle. Okay, this one's gonna be annoying to open. Oh no, I dropped it after. <laughs> Luckily, you didn't. This time. Yet. I'm stuck to my finger. What was it? So. They're a little. Yeah, they should have just put it in the same packet as the other one. You have to open it the little sideways method. Don't see how you do that, but I can't see I'm um, bad at navigating. Yeah, that goes weird when you. Looks like this from a boob. So, uh, may I try it first since I love banana? I'll set it up here. Can you hold this then? I can set it. I'm, I'm smart enough to set it up. And then you. Does it taste nice? No, absolutely horrible. <laughs> okay, let's see. Oh, you don't get this. I do get to try, I'm the payer. How does the chocolate taste though? Did it taste fake? The chocolate was very nice. From when I got a bit on my thing, finger and then... But I couldn't taste it because the banana is very overwhelming. Okay. Hmm. See what I mean? Maybe you want to get a lot of it on. Okay, that was maybe a bit too much. It's like a type of, <clears throat> type of um, gum I had that was banana flavored. Yeah, it is. The gum that is. Surprising a chocolate doesn't taste too fake either. Japan don't usually have fake tasting food though, do they? Not usually. No, it's um. Ah, mine has a flick. Like, no offence whatsoever to America, but here she, it just is so fake tasting. It's nice though. It's nice but not too much because you can eventually taste that it's a lot different from what we have. Because we have dairy milk and Cadbury's. Don't they have to change the recipe when it comes over here as well, though, as well? I believe so, yeah. Because Unless you go to the actual American sweet stores. 
they have to change a bit of the recipe because of certain colorants and chemicals we're not allowed yeah oh that's what i've been told anyway and the last one's mine so i think that's your third one right yeah that's your third one i've had two a bit in half by accident accident she says as she uh, proceeds to claim more chocolate. Mmm. Oh. So I'd say five. Yeah, so by default, since she's left lots of chocolate and lots of sprinkles, the rest of mine. Oi. Alright then. Okay, so that's the last of the box. Um, what was your favourite thing? You think? Mm. That's hard, because I really love this. There's packs in here. I really loved these. And what was it? What else is it? These are really nice. I believe I said these are really nice. Hmm. I'm going to have to go with these, I believe. Ah, um, well done. And yeah, I believe I'm going to have to go with these, but I'm going to give them a 5. I think I gave this a 5. This is here, and this is a package from the finish off earlier, so. You're going to have to get a hoover. <laughs> Stop sprinkles, everyone. Um, I'll get it. Mine, I would say the Kit Kats. Oh yeah, 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 that's the other one I was forgetting, Kit Kats. Yeah, they were really good. They were really good. I'm going to say it's probably a tie between those three. Definitely. So that was the last Tokyo Treats box I'll be getting for a while no, due to money and saving up for a holiday, actually, to Disneyland Paris in October yep. for My Halloween. My first time out of the UK ever. Yeah. Um... But if we end up going to a Comic Con, I'll be vlogging there, hopefully. Mm -hmm. And also possibly on a trip to um, Aberystwyth. I want to do my Yamcha cosplay again, because I realise I can do the Yamcha from GT. Mm. Um, also, as you probably noticed, there's a Flag Fires You're Welcome tour posted back there me and jamie went on holiday in uh, a holiday went to see it in cardiff um and it was really really good it was amazing it was so funny they were uh, and <laughs> <laughs> um so yeah it's very it was very interesting and I suggest if he goes on tour again and he goes anywhere near you, your, where you live or a near, nearby city, it's definitely, definitely go see, see it. It's worth Especially money. if you do like Mark, but obviously if you don't, there's probably no point going. <laughs> obviously. But, you know. Um, and Jack Subsikai is on tour at the moment. Yeah, I heard about that. In yeah. America. So, he looks like he's having a lot of fun as well because he did the thing where he went to, was it Philadelphia? Philadelphia. He went up the steps that Rocky went. Oh. Every time I hear so Philadelphia, I just think the cream cheese. Yeah. Yeah, cream no, cheese. <laughs> anyway, um, yeah, we'll be doing, uh, well, I'll be doing reviews and so on now. And uh, I hope, as I've said, I hope to get a game cap card soon. And once we get that, we'll hopefully either do multiplayer or something on a few games like, um, inf uh, well, World War Two maybe on the PlayStation 4. Why do you say that? That's my game, not yours. <laughs> That's why I said multiplayer. Um, Infinite Warfare and all those sort of things. So hopefully everything will come together and more videos will be uploaded a lot more frequently. Anyway, um, mm -hmm. stop copying me. Copy me. Thank you for coming and joining me and doing the last. It's my pleasure. I get to eat food. 
Yeah, a benefit for him. <laughs> and uh, see you in the next video. Ciao. Bye bye.